Okay, again, quite a few people asking why there's so many different shapes of the ocean angler micro jigs. There's a knife, a weasel, a viper, and a diamond. And they've all got different actions on the fall. So let's just go through them one by one. Um, first thing you're going to notice in all the ocean angler micro jigs is the UV blast symbol. So they've all got a UV reflective sealer coat on them, which makes them more visible to fish and will give you that edge over other micro jigs. So let's take this one out of the packet and have a look at it. This is the knife one. So this is like a, a mini kingfish jig. This is a 60 gram one. And you'll notice this distraction pattern of Lumo paint which when it falls, it flashes around and um, attracts fish to the lure. And um, what you'll, first thing you'll notice is, is, you know, let's have a look at the hooks. So we use two hooks on all our micro jigs because, you know, it kind of makes sense to us. Two hooks, two points, more hookups. If one hook falls out, the other one could uh, stay in the fish and so you, it won't get off. So we reckon it's just better to have... Um, two hooks rather than one on your micro jigs. So they're all different shapes. This is like a mini kingfish knife jig. So it's quite symmetrical. And how it falls, it goes, when it falls down, it goes round in big wide circles. It gets down quite easily. So it's quite good to use out in the um, deeper waters. You know, if you're micro jigging under workup, something like that. This one works really well. The action is um, slow mechanical jigging. So it, it goes down in a circle, and then you can twitch it up, but you got to, and then it falls on the horizontal. So make sure you let it fall on the horizontal, and it's important to let it sit on the bottom as well. So that's the knife jig for deeper waters when it's a bit windier for getting down, and um, yeah, maybe windy days with a bit of current round. That's a good size to do it. Now I've t tested. Don't get hung up on the word micro jig too much. People are saying. You know, micro jig, it's 60 grams, how can it be a micro jig? So as long as it works. So 60 gram is good for out in the, in the <coughs> uh, 30 to kind of 45 meter range. <coughs> Excuse me, I've got a bit of a cold at the moment. So that's the knife one. <coughs> now let's have a look at the weasel. <coughs> Excuse me. So this is a different shape once again. This is 40 grams. Hey, let's take this one out and have a look. Now this colour here is a very popular colour overseas. You know, we were researching what colours to do. This pop colour kept on popping up time and time again. So we use the same colour ourselves. Once again, two hooks. And the shape of this one, it's a little, just about symmetrical, but not quite. So this one will get down easier. It won't go down in a big, wide, uh, big round circles. It goes down um, quite fast, and it's more of a twitchy style one. So being symmetrical, it's twitchy, and you dart it around a lot. It darts around, lots of twitchy action on the rod, and um, and once again, let it fall, and make sure you let it rest on the bottom because the snapper like to pick these jigs up. You know, I've found a lot of the time when they're doing nothing, just sitting on the bottom. You know, maybe the the upwards twitching attracts them, and then the falling and sitting on the bottom, then they move in. So that is the weasel shape. You know, that's a top colour, and this is all glow in the dark paint. You probably can't see it, but that's all glow in the dark paint as well. You know, quality hooks, two hooks once again. Then we move on to the Viper, which is a different type of shape. And this shape here is for um, calmer waters or shallower waters because it doesn't get down as fast. It has more hang time. It's flatter. It's a bit like a mini slow pitch jig. You'll see that it's flat. It's got a slender profile, um, weighted at the bottom. And what this does, it goes down horizontally. So you twitch it up. And then it falls down horizontally, so it takes longer to get down, more hang time, so uh, more time in the strike zone. And so this, the Viper, is a good shape for calm days in shallow water, because it goes down a lot slower, it vibrates on the fall. 
so that's your calm, those glassy calm days out in the Paraki Golf when the Nchiku jigs and ones with rubber bits on them don't work so well because there's no not much current or wind to push you along try one of these ones it's a calm water shallow water micro jig once again with UV uh, blast sealer coat on it and lastly is the diamond shape which is kind of a, a cross between the flat shape and the uh, knife shape so let's open it up have a look <coughs> excuse me it's supposed to be at the Tauranga boat show but I couldn't go because I really am I've got a bit of a cough so this one is a mixture of both it's you know it's not the same on both sides so it'll go down fast but if you give a lift up of your rod tip and take the energy out of it so it has like a moment of, of zero kind of gravity, it'll go on its side and it'll go down horizontally. So you've got the best of both worlds with this one. It's got the distraction pattern on it. It's a, uh, you know, it's a very popular shape, this one. So that's the best of both worlds. I would use that, um, you know, you can use that in calm and the, uh, you know, when there's a bit of wind around. So that's a real universal shape. So that's the uh, diamond, it's a universal shape, just to go through them once again. That one is the Viper, flat, calm waters, shallow waters, more hang time. This is the weasel, this is the twitchy twitchy one, so lots of twitching and then let it fall, goes down quite easily, so good for when there's a bit of wind around. And finally, the knife, which is a mini kingfish jig. Goes down round in big circles, gets down quite easily, and um, goes down on the horizontal when you, you know, get that, uh, give it a twitch up with your rod, let it fall. And um, I must say that out in the deep at the moment with the fish are in spring, that would be my favourite one, is the 60 gram knife in silver. So there you go. That's why we've got so many shapes for our micro jigs. Um, you know, they're in most of the shops now, they're about 10 bucks each, something like that, 10, 11 bucks each. And, you know, they've got two hooks on them, because two hooks is better than one. Thanks for watching.